What's up, Metalheads? My name is Jamie. This is the Blades and EDC channel. Thank you guys so much for being here. I really do appreciate it. And the day you're watching this video, the live stream is tonight, 9 p.m. Eastern, for the giveaway. And what I'm about to show you was donated to the channel by Good Screw. Great people. Love these guys. Best marketing team in the uh, community, in my opinion. Funny as can be. And what they have donated to you guys... I'm going to do a little overview of here. This is the brass prototype good screw with the brass bit holder. And I'm going to give you my thoughts and opinions on it. But keep in mind, this is a prototype. This is not the final product, the final variation that will be sold in production. So, Because there are a couple things that I want to point out about this. In particular, the bit holder. The good screw, just as good as any other good screw. It's as good of a good screw as you're going to get screwed with. So... It's, it's good. It's really good. I mean, they're fantastic. The bearings they use in these things, this thing would just sit here and spin the whole video if I let it. Um, only complaint about this that I could have is a complaint about this too, but there's nothing you can really do about it when you use brass. It's the smell it leaves on your hands. So after you use this thing some, yeah, yeah, I can just smell. You know, you've got old copper pennies in your hand. You can smell that copper smell, brassy smell. That, you get a little bit of that on your hands with this. Not a big deal, but just want to point it out. Other than that, this thing is fantastic. It works extremely well. I mean, magnetic. It's got some weight to it. We're going to weigh it in a minute because I have no idea what it weighs. But it definitely weighs more than the titanium version of this of the good screw. This thing's awesome. There's the good screw logo engraved in there. Or milled out in there. These things are just really... They're very functional tools. They work extremely well. But in my opinion, they're almost like art. You know? I have no idea what the cost on these are going to be. I know the uh, titanium versions like $120, I think. And then the Timascus versions like $200. So I don't know how much the brass is going to be. I'd imagine it will be a little less, but I'm not sure about that. So don't hold me to that. I mean, it's patina. Have a, it already had a low patina on it when it got here. As you can see the black spots. But it will continue to patina like that as it gets older. And you can get uh, brass polish to take that off and make this thing nice and shiny if you want to. But I kind of like uh, I like this patina look. Um, it also includes a replacement bearing and the box and everything. And to get to that, use a flathead screwdriver. I think you need to use a coin and get in there and take that out and your bearing's in there and you can replace your bearing. So, so you get an extra bearing. There's nothing wrong with this bearing. This thing will just spin and spin and spin. So Now, let's talk about the bit holder. It spins also, right? Um, if you spin it fast, it makes that noise. Not really a problem because this isn't made to do that. It's made to do this, and you're, you're, you know your driver's sitting up there, and you just go around and grab the one you want. But it's not as quiet as this. Oh, man, it's a solid. If you drop this thing on your toe, you're gonna break your toe. FYI, this thing is. This thing is solid, man. So solid. But here's the one thing I really want to point about this. Other than the smell, right, that you get from brass, and the, the sound it makes when you spin it fast, which isn't really a problem because these aren't made. Unless you're a crazy person and like to fidget with things like me, this isn't really made for fidgeting. <laughs> Neither is this, but you can fidget. But here's the one thing I do want to point out about the bit holder. A couple of these, we'll use the T6 here. That one's good. This is one of the rough ones. A couple of these are kind of rough. That goes in and out, but it just feels a little rough. And when I look down, leave that there so I don't lose it. When I look down inside there, and this is for good screw also, because they'll watch this video also. You can see, I don't know if that's like the patina starting to build up on there, or if something's just kind of rough in there, but... I can see where it's rubbing and it's kind of white right there in that area, which makes me think it's just starting to patina in there and maybe some corrosion or something. I don't know. I don't know that much about brass, but a couple of these holes, a couple of these holes are not as slick as you'd want them to be. You may require some KY or something. Well, or some, no, nah, I'm kidding. They'll be fine. There's just a couple of them that are, that's one, that's one, those two. The rest are fine. There's two of these holes that just, it goes in and out of them, but it's just, it feels a little rough going in and out to where the rest of them 
And this is magnetic also, by the way. The rest of them, it'll just drop right down in there. No problem at all. And you can hold one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight bits, and it will include some bits, just FYI. Uh, where's the... Oh, there it is. There it is. So you will get two sets of bits with this. Torx, and I'm not sure. I mean, you get Allen, Phillips, straight. Um, I would recommend going ahead and upgrading to Weeha bits. These are B rope, B R O P P E. I'm not familiar at all with this company, so I would be cautious about using these. If you have Weeha bits, just go ahead and use Weeha bits. Uh, I mean, you'll probably be okay with these, but they're probably not going to hold up as long as Weeha bits will. And I always worry about stripping things, so we will get two sets of bits with this giveaway. Also, whoever wins the good screw and some stickers and uh yeah very very kind of them to donate this and whoever wins this will have one of the only ones in, out there in the world because uh this is a prototype so i do want to weigh this thing man because this thing it has some serious weight to it let's see here get those out of the way let's weigh the driver first i mean this thing is feel uh, you could almost use this as a quack quack it's, just how well it's built. They do such a good, such good work. They are impressive, and they're making knife scales now too, guys. For uh, Chris Reeves knives, I will be doing an install. So the driver is 5.7 ounces. Bit holder probably a little more. I'd say closer to seven or eight ounces. 9.3 ounces all together. You are looking at 15 ounces of, of brass. So wish it was gold. I wouldn't be giving it away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I wouldn't give it away though. Of course, gold would not work well for this. It's too soft. Brass is a very hard metal, so this will work well. You just gotta, I don't know. It's not as bad as pennies, but I just smell it. So it's just one of those things. I'm jealous of whoever wins this. I don't even have a bit holder. I like the bit holder. It's so cool. And this will probably work with almost any driver. Let's try a different one here. It probably doesn't have to be a good screwdriver. Maybe not. No, it does not work with any driver. I was wrong about that. Very cool. Thank you so much to Good Screw. I really do appreciate it. And I hope to see all you guys in the live stream tonight at 9 p.m. Eastern. Uh, it's already on the channel. If you go to my channel and click on where it says live, you'll see the stream there, 2K giveaway. And uh, you turn, make sure your notifications are turned on so you don't miss out because you will have to be in the live stream to win. Uh, this isn't going to be one of those where you leave a comment and I choose it later. It's going to be chosen right there during the stream. I will pick the winner and you have to be there to win. So uh, not only this, all the prizes being given away. And there are some very cool prizes. This one's going to be a standalone prize. This is a valuable a valuable giveaway here very valuable you're probably looking 150 to 200 dollars for this thing would be my guess uh with the bit holder maybe a little more because man it's so nice so so nice but this is one of those things it's not like a knife you know what i mean you get a, a, an expensive knife and you don't want to use it because you don't want to scratch it you know, this is a tool a knife is a tool also but use this thing man use it you're gonna love it they're so good and uh with all that being said anyway, head out watching that I can tell you this will last longer than that this has the weight of that on it this thing will just spin forever still spinning still spinning this is still spinning fast Thank you guys so much, and I hope to see you all tonight, and if not, I'll see you guys on the next one.